Kirk gets humbled because of he has a spate uh, a ru- a sequence of decisions which really hurt the crew and the ship. Um, and so he's learning a little bit of humbleness, like he can make mistakes. But the takeaway for me was, when you're young and brash, be arrogant, cheat, make mistakes. You know, shoot for the shoot a uh, high, shoot high, and then learn a little bit of sprinkling some humbleness later. later. Don't do the opposite. Don't do exactly. the opposite. Yeah. It is my function aboard this ship to advise you in making the wisest decisions possible, something I firmly believe you are incapable of doing in this moment. You're right. What I'm about to do, it doesn't make any sense. It's not logical. It is a gut feeling. I have no idea what I'm supposed to do. I only know what I can do. The Enterprise and her crew need someone in that chair that knows what he's doing. And it's not me. It's you, Spock. So now, now you've got a little bit of a confidence hit there, Kirk. So once you've you know, broken the rules, bent the rules, cheated talked back to people, stepped on people's heads. Now you're at the captain of the Enterprise. Oh, now, oh, oh, now. Uh, look I, how I, humble I, I am. I should step back. I'm so humble. Right, right, right. But you're already the captain of the Enterprise. So That's right. Shoot to the top and then bring it back. Right. Because, I mean, if you if he did not shoot to the top and then bring it back to be humble, then he would just be a depressed person <laughs> right? like because like, if because if there's plenty of people that are humble on the ship they're just not captains like they're just random people in the background of the ship they don't have they're they're not right. cocky enough they're not cock right. full they're not cockalicious they're not, they're not cockalicious enough to like to swing with the fences to do the dangerous stuff to do the braggadocious stuff that that uh, that kirk does so i guess i guess this is actually a very good lesson actually like a life lesson is be a bit cocky, like be a bit cocky and try some stuff that's risky. As long as it's not really offensive, as long as you mm-hmm. can skirt the lines and get through there on charisma mm-hmm. and charm, then yeah, yeah, go for it. Because then when you're super high up on the clouds, you're top, you're top of the game, you're number one, then you'd be like, oh, I'm humble. You know, I just want to yeah. have a you know, yeah. nice relaxed night tonight. Because like, right. if, if, you, if you're humble from the beginning, right out of Starflight Academy, yeah. humble, 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 humble. Now you're like a lowly lieutenant. You like turn on the arrogance a little bit. Like, oh, good, you've learned arrogance, but... <laughs> You're not Captain Kirk. Right. Good job. Good job. I mean, good, good, good for him to be a little bit less arrogant, but yeah. I think the overall lesson is to be arrogant. Be arrogant. Oh. Yep. 